Hello and welcome back to our channel. This week, well, funny, not funny about this channel. This week, we're doing a week on Tesco Value Food. This, this is Tesco Value the brands. Yeah. Some of the frozen food, they changed their branding to make it look like it's not Tesco Value, but it is. Yeah. Which is quite a clever little marketing thing. But we're doing a week on Tesco Value. We've got a few foods here for a few days. And we're back to Tesco tomorrow to get more stuff for breakfast, lunch, dinners, rest of the week. This will be a good challenge though. I think fair. Oh, this food looks nice to me. What are we going to eat for lunch? For lunch we're going to have the pizza each. Look, it's got quite a lot of cheese in it for Tesco Value Pizza. It's very nice, yeah. And we're going to share the ready meals out. So when we have ready meal, we're going to have half each one. So we cook two at a time. Yeah. Have half of each one. So that'd be good. So the week for Tesco Value. Hopefully you enjoy this. We'll be back when the food's in the oven. Catherine's turned the oven, I don't know why. How, how long do you think? Um, well, you should read the back of the package. <laughs> it takes about 12 to 14 minutes. But you better be putting that pizza on a tray with a simple no, one. No, do in. not put it straight, I'm not eating it. Catherine put the pizza. She thought my little stomach would just eat that. But she no. put in the pepperoni in with no trans meat. Got a lot, quite a lot of pepperoni in there for 60p, it's quite good. Do, do, do you want to? Okay, I'll do that part. There we go. Whilst our pizza's in the oven looking kind of a bit like Catherine's one's not really pretty much. Um, I'm going to try some of this everyday value. Everyday value sugar free cola. The packaging looks so pleasing. Okay, really, guys. Hopefully, it doesn't make spillage. Oh, it's going out. Oh, wait. Oh, 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 the fish turned into drink. <laughs> it's like a never lasting bottle of Coke. Our Catherine's like. Oh, fuck. Actually, no, it's not gonna. Don't worry. What's that doing on your finger, Catherine? This ring. Yeah, what does it mean to you? It's a promise ring. Who from? From you. Thank you. Uh, and what's the promise? That one day we'll get married. <laughs> okay, nice. <laughs> Alright, twice quite a little bit. I'm gonna clap it now. Just do wine tasting. You could try some too. That just tastes quite nice. So the whole pizza is just over half a saturated salad day. Quite bad. There's lots of sugars in here. Lots and lots of salt. The pepperoni only has 60% of the salt you can tell a day in the one pizza. Pepperoni overall is a lot more unhealthy, obviously, but. It's got more flavour and. Nah, she should try yeah. it. No, I'm not trying any of yours actually. It's not cooked. Um, so, for the Tesco Valley pizzas, they are actually very good value for money, and I recommend them to you. This is the final product of the pizzas, as you can see. To be fair, they've got not a lot of cheese in it, but it smells good. And yeah. we're cutting into them now. Can't, they're really hot. I can't wait to see what these taste like. <laughs> all, the <laughs> all the saturates in here. Okay, let me, let me give it a bite. It's on camera for you guys, first hand. You get the dough smells, smells fresh, but it's clearly not, is it? I see it's MP. Eat it, really good. Yeah. Very, very tiny tomato -y. <laughs> Look, I see it's MP. It is good. Yeah, yeah I, I uh, think for the, for the money, like. Sainsbury's own is like it? twice the price and tastes exactly the same, so... You haven't tried it yet. <laughs> well, I'll try it now then. Is that cutting skills? Catherine should work in a pizza hut. No, no, Joe works there. <laughs> Shade. Shade. Ready? Go. We need some words, Catherine. <laughs> the flavour is good, but the base is a bit soggy, but that's my fault. This so is a good I can't really give an accurate review. <laughs> Forget about the base being soggy. How does it taste? The flavour on top, I really like it. And there's lots of pepperoni as well. Yeah, it's good. Right, so. Might be a good, I'll burn that bit. For the price of this, I'd recommend this to anyone. Okay, we put some 
that pizza is good, guys. But through this breakfast, we are starving. So, the much more things we're going to put the Yorkshire puddings in. 50 pins, guys, for 15 Yorkshire puddings. Do the maths, a 3.23 Yorkshire pudding. Yeah. I'm going to put these straight in the other. They're little things, ain't they? 50p, guys. 50p. For all of these bad boys. They're really hot. So don't touch them, Kevin. They're really hot. Okay, let's see what Catherine's intake on Yorkshire pudding is. Too hot. <laughs> I'll, I'll eat the same one as she Okay. Good. It tastes yeah. exactly like Yorkshire pudding, so yeah. thumbs up for that one. Would say rate out of 10, Kathy, in that one. I'll give it 8 out of 10. Yeah, I'd say solid 7, 8. Yeah. But I just wanted to say this isn't actually strange for us. We do just sit and eat Yorkshire pudding sometimes. Yeah, a couple goals that is, guys. Do it with your girlfriend or boyfriend or dog. <laughs> Wherever you're into, you do it with them. Oh, Sid's just broke his neck. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Where are my balls? Oh. Sid's company fifth wheel in. Okay. Ha, ha, ha. Oh, yeah, I can't remember. <laughs> We're now in the room where all the magic happens. <laughs> and Catherine's eating her crisp. She's gone for her salt and vinegar and uh, cheese and onion. Well, I've gone I start eating my caramel wafer bar, but it actually tastes pink. Five of these for 40p and 12 bags of crisps for 66p. How do, how do the crisps taste in Catherine, to be honest with you? They're good. Like they're just small, like you have to have a couple of bags at once. That's her excuse to be greedy. <laughs> that is literally her excuse to be greedy. It's been low that little goofy smile. <laughs> In my opinion, the wafer bar is good. It's really filling, but you, you can taste the caramel in it. It's not like no knockoff Nigel job. There's no botched job in it. It's proper caramel in it. I can taste it. There's no botched job, no botched job. Okay, we're going to get a crisp out of 10. You always got like a 60 second delay, don't you? I'll say you, i say something to you. You don't have apply to for a, my answer. Yeah, well, you'd be thinking I'm supposed to a hard answer. It's number between 1 and 10, Catherine. 7. <laughs> 7, that's good. And the way far, I'd give a 7.5. The packaging just, just put me off a little bit. But yeah. Nah. Saying the packaging puts you off. Packaging isn't very aesthetically pleasing, guys. Well. It's not. So Catherine's just chatting shit because she's either mugged her off and that's it, don't we? I'll, I'll make it better. There you go. I made, made her feel better now. But yeah, we'll be back later for dinner. I, I think today and tonight we're going to have the rice, the curry, the chicken curry, korma curry, and the uh, sweet and sour cheese. No, sweet and sour curry. Mac and cheese. Oh, mac and cheese. She wants cheese. What we know about Catherine is that belly is full of cheese. That's what you would know about Catherine. <laughs> She's gone red like a tomato where she never eats any of those. Lunch made, filled us up quite a little bit actually. I do watch pins as well, but to be honest, I'm feeling really hungry now. We've left it really late for dinner. We had a late lunch though because we've woke up so late this morning. But yeah, we're going for the head in the hole. It's both Tesco value, guys. A mac and cheese, 65p each. But dilemma, guys. Can't put this in the microwave. We have to put it in the oven 45 minutes. So we just reheated my oven. Just moved in. We'll do a full house tour soon. SJ Kirby is bottom floor with me. I live with vegans. So I don't think this will go down the street. But I don't want to try some. Or three. No, we're hungry. Shout out to the guy that does these videos because I don't know his name. I've got it. I watch him all the time. It's just some guy who's got his wife and he's got some black cat. You'll know him, maybe. But he's a good guy. He, he got me inspired for these videos. Let's go. Cut. Okay. This is our dinner. Mac and cheese with Yorkshire pudding. It's played in the hole. So about a finger there. Let's try some. Mac and cheese. So good, guys. 65p. Um, let's try some toe in the hole now. You overcooked toe in the hole slightly because I'm just an idiot. Okay, it's a bit of toad in the hole. Mmm. That is good, guys. Alright, guys. Hey, guys. That was today's meal. That dinner was actually so lovely. What do you yeah. think of the meal? 
I thought it was really nice. Yeah, for that, 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 that was that again. Both our meals there combined was one pound seven. Well, one six. I said one pound thirty. A bit more than that coke, but one p worth of that coke we had. So first day, and it's gone well. The food I've actually really enjoyed. Yeah. All of it today, all of it. At least tomorrow we'll, we'll have breakfast, lunch, and dinner. We'll wake up on time. We're gonna go to Tesco get some breakfast stuff. All value, lunch and dinner. Tomorrow's video will be less time because obviously the first video we're trying to explain what we're doing, and like eating the food. But we spend more time on the first video. It'll get. It'll be like seven minutes tomorrow's one eight minutes. Don't have to get so bored. Yeah. So we'll, we'll, we'll shorten it down. Yeah. So we'll see you tomorrow. Videos coming out every day about one o'clock in the morning latest. But it'll probably come out because we had dinner late today, so that's why it's later. It'll probably come about ten o'clock at night. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you tomorrow.